Hello, beautiful people. How are you guys doing today? This is Augusta Dunbar coming at you again. And I had another topic that was on my mind. I said not think a lot, so there's going to be quite a few videos coming up. But I remember back when I didn't necessarily know, I didn't have any specified goals. I just wanted to be rich. I just wanted to be wealthy. And I just wanted to make a lot of money. And whenever someone asked me why, I would say, well, because it's obvious I don't want to have to work for the rest of my life I want to be able to enjoy life so I just want to you know get money and then be able to lounge around and do nothing or do whatever and I have since learned that that's just a myth it's a fairy tale no one does that no one who aspires to, to, to be more and do more and is super ambitious gets money and then sits around and does nothing okay no one and I like to give you guys this example I've had the pleasure of making an acquaintance named Rick Grady. Uh, Rick Grady is a public official for the city of Plano. I'm not sure exactly what his title is. He has a, he has a few different positions. But Rick Grady is a very successful uh, guy. Uh, he's probably an entrepreneur. But I know that he was once with a small IT firm that got bought out and he was one of the shareholders. And ever since then, Rick hasn't had to worry about money. And he was one of the first few people I had ever met that didn't have to worry about money. And I always wonder what that felt like. Like, you don't have to worry about rent. You don't have to worry about a car. No, you don't have to worry. You don't have to worry or think about money whatsoever. Anything he wants to do, he can just do. And it was so crazy when I met him because I was talking to him about, you know, his lifestyle, what he does. And he let me know he had three jobs. And I'm like, Rick, why? Why? You know, like, you don't need money. Why the hell would you have three jobs? And he said, Augusta, I love helping people. Okay? So I know one of his positions for the city of Plano is he helps solve homelessness. He helps people get off the streets of, of Plano. And I wouldn't think that there's homelessness in Plano, but there is. And it was just powerful. He was just like, yeah, I have three jobs. They just so happen to pay me. I would do it for free. I just love helping people and giving back. And I thought that was powerful, guys. And I sat and I thought, man, that is so selfish of me to just want to get, you know, wealth and then just do nothing with it not give back and not help people right so i would just ask you you know what would you do if money wasn't an issue you had enough of it you didn't ever have to think of it again how would your day look like you know what would your lifestyle look like i think that we get so caught up sometimes in making a living that we forgot that we forget to design a life right we get so caught up in the day-to-day -day, our concerns our complaints our problems our fiascos and we don't stop to think like what do i want out of life who do i want to become who do i want to associate with and what things do i want to do what do i want my legacy what yeah, there you go what do i want my legacy to look like right so i don't want you to just you know like and subscribe which that'd be great too but i want to actually like hear your feedback like post a comment below and let me know you know if money wasn't a problem I would be doing blank I would be helping blank I would be solving blank right let me know I'm very curious to hear what you guys think about this uh, till next time see you guys at the top bye